Hi, quick update, um, three things. One, furlough. Um, so just a quick update to say that furlough claims, so if you're an employer from this month, you must put in your furlough claim by the 14th of the following month. So any furlough claims for November need to be submitted by the 14th of December um, and so on. So that is a change. Um, so last month you had until the end of November. So for October you had to the end of November. So now you only get two weeks and so make sure you get them in. Um, more so for cash flow than anything else, but just so you don't lose out. Um, so secondly, VAT. So those of you that deferred your VAT payment for um, one of the quarters that was in the deferral scheme earlier the year in the year. So the initial guidance was that you have until the end of March to repay that. So March next year. They are now, um, HMRC have now said that you can now pay this by the end of March the following year, but you must pay it in monthly instalments. From So you can pay it in up to 12 monthly instalments between March next year and March the following year. So it all has to be cleared by March 2022. Um, you have to opt in to this scheme, so you can't just go along and then start paying it monthly. Um, HMRC will release how to actually opt in um, in the new year. So come January, I'll let you know how you actually do this um, and you have to have a direct debit in place. Um, and you also must have no VAT returns outstanding. Um, so apart from obviously the payment for the one that was in the deferral scheme, but you mustn't be behind in submitting any of your VAT returns, etc. So if you have any backlog, do it now. Um, and then thirdly, the self-employment income support scheme, so the uh, the new round of applications ha could start yesterday. Um, there is new criteria this time, uh, a lot stricter. So one of those is you must have seen a significant reduction in your trading profits due to COVID. Um, and that is not just due to increased costs for PPE. So that is not accepted as, a, as, an, as an excuse or a reason this time just to have increased costs um, in order to claim this grant and you must be continuing to trade um, and your your profits on your tax return should show the lower profits um, for the year. Um, now, depending on when your, your year end, if, you, if you're in line with the tax year, then it will be your 2021 tax return. Um, so, yeah, make sure that, you know, you are um, eligible to claim before you do do claim this otherwise they will be coming back to ask for money back um if you're currently running self-employment business and you're thinking well i'm just going to convert to a limited company now um but you have been affected so you you know you do actually qualify for claiming um the self-employment income support scheme grant this time around i would not go down a company route because effectively you're not intending to continue to trade as uh, self-employed um, so not at the moment anyway. So that's it. Just a quick update. Um, have a good Tuesday. Bye bye.